You have the Blue View 4. Looks like this super cool robotic style futuristic design on the back. You've heard you can make your phone faster. You've heard correctly, you can. So it's going to feel complex, but we're going to enter something called developer options, and then we'll make three changes to the phone, and then we'll compare it to the View 3. I know it's a different phone, but you'll be able to clearly see that this phone, the Blue, the 4, that we're going to make some adjustments to will look like it's running, well, actually will run faster, snappier, cleaner, and your phone ultimately will be easier to use. So let's get right into it. We have to go into something called developer options. To get to the developer options, follow these instructions. We're going to go into settings. Swipe up. Most people swipe up to get to the settings. All your apps are in alphabetical order. Type touch settings. Inside settings. We're going to scroll all the way down to the very bottom and touch about device, about device. Inside about device, we're going to scroll all the way to the very bottom and we're going to look for the words called build number right here, build number, build number. We're going to just, there's no button, but we're going to touch it seven times and watch what happens. One, two, three, four, you getting that message, five, six, seven times. You are now a developer. That's what we want to have happen. Okay. If that didn't happen for you, it's either your phones already has the developer options on or just do it again. Okay. Once we get that message that says you are a developer, go back one. And now we're back into settings. Now that we're back into settings, scroll all the way down again. We're at the bottom. Now touch system and inside system, you'll see that the developer options is now on touch developer options. Hey, make sure it's toggled on here. It should be. Now, inside developer options, be careful not to touch anything. We're just going to scroll down a ways. You're going to see these headings debugging. You're going to see another heading networking. Uh, keep scrolling. We're going to see input and now drawing right here, drawing. And we're looking for these three options right here. Window animation scale, transition animation scale, and animator duration scale. We're only going to change these. And let me assure you that if you don't like how your phone operates after this, you, all you're changing is a simple thing, a simple way that the animations work in your phone. Just come back in and change them back. Okay, it's that easy. So let's just touch the first one, window animation scale touch. Some people say to go from 1 to 0.5. The smaller the number, the quicker the phone will work. Definitely don't go bigger numbers because then your phone will go really slow. I like to turn my animations all the way off. Off. Okay. That's the first one we do. The second one we do is transition animation scale. Touch that one. Animation off. And the last one we're going to do is the animator duration scale. Touch that one. Animation off. And that is it. We're done. You can either back out by touching the arrow to back out or we can just go to home screen. That's it. You are done. You just hacked your phone. Kind of. All right. So let's prove that it's different now. Now I'm going to first touch the blue three the view three, and I want you to pay attention to what happens. Did you see how that icon kind of like shifted to the side and then grew? Now watch what happens when I close it. Do you see how the, the screen kind of like swipes down to go away? It takes a moment. Okay. Now watch what happens when we touch the four that we've made those adjustments to touch the phone blinks right open, no waiting. And when we close it brings blinks right closed. Let's do uh, messenger, see if uh, that will go for us. Blinks right on. Now what happens when we close it? Close, close. Oops, I didn't touch it. Let's do messenger again, just to see our eyes can see that. Messenger, blinks right on, it's ready to go. Let's close it again. Blinks right off and this one kind of closes down. Let's do camera, one last, one last example, camera camera the four blinks right on and then the three kind of grew into the software let's let's close it see how that just like closes slowly and this one just blink blinks off so your four when you make these adjustments your phone will operate quicker snappier cleaner it will feel great to use this phone it will feel like a new phone if you've been using it for a while and again if you don't like those settings log back into developer options and turn them back to 1x. You'll be fine. All right. 
If this has helped you with your Blue View 4, leave a comment that says, yeah, I noticed a difference. Or if it doesn't work for you, just say, say leave a comment that says, I, yeah, it didn't work for me. But I want to thank you for watching. Please like, please subscribe. And uh, that's it. Enjoy your day.